All right, YouTube, in this video, I want to tell you how social media is killing your games. Before we get into it, before we get into my points my top of the topic, hit the like button, subscribe below, um, notification bell, click the link below to save 15% on Javi Coffee. They got some wonderful stuff. Even if you don't buy anything, just click the link, see what they got. Maybe you'll like it, maybe you won't. All right, let's get into it. Social media is killing your games. And when I mean games, I do not only mean building muscle. I mean building muscle, losing fat, burning calories, all that good stuff. Everything that comes with fitness, right? So it's killing your games. Why? I'm just judging of what I see in the gym every day. Not just the long conversations and a lack of um, doing things because a lot of these guys and women they go in the gym they're very highly motivated just as motivated or more than me sometimes um you know but the difference is the way we go about our workouts all right i'm a dedicated lifter i'm a dedicated to my diet i'm dedicated to my reps and sets and putting in the work I'm dedicated to not talking in the gym, right? So, I just said I wasn't gonna talk about that. I'm not gonna talk about it much. It's the way you do it. It's okay to talk in the gym. It's not okay for me because I've been through so much that it's like damaged me a lot to where a few words can throw off my whole workout. I get all mad, I lose focus, start tripping, anxiety kicks in. It's a wrap because of stuff that I've been through. So you ain't been through it. I don't expect you to understand. Um, but social media, the way people work out on videos is not the way people work out in real life. All right. That's the difference between me and other YouTube influencers. I try to give you what's real. And you might think it's boring, but at the end of the day, it's what's going to get you to your goals. You know what I'm saying? If you look up any of my lifting videos, there's no flashiness there's no helicopters flying through and and, and speed boats and and crazy music well except my first videos i didn't edit out any of the copyrighted music so go back to those videos if you want to hear music on rapid time fitness videos you know not music i put on but music that was playing in the gym you know half of it wasn't my cup of tea but that's not what we're talking about all right we're talking about people that go in the gym and try to mimic and emulate what they see on YouTube. They go in the gym, they do a few little weak sets, they warm up, they high five, they, they act like they're in a party, they, they're they burning calories, don't get me wrong, but they could be burning way more calories if they was actually putting in the work, all right? The work, why are y'all in the robe? Look at these, show up the robe, man. That's why I be looking at the camera, I mean the robe, instead of the camera because there's always people doing stupid stuff but what i'm trying if you really know nobody be doing none of the stuff that you be saying you do be doing rapid time what world did you live in where don't nobody be doing stupid stuff please tell me because i would love to visit that world i would love to move there <laughs> you know what i'm saying what inhabitable planet that you can breathe on that you live in that somehow you're getting broadcasted the rapid time fitness videos that's dope. Hey, salute for you watching. But at the end of the day, where do... Don't tell me where you live. You know what I'm saying? Like, what planet are you from? You know what I'm saying? What planet are you from, all right? Hey, man. That's, that just tells me... That, that makes me think that most people are the way that I'm talking about. So people go in the gym and they, they do all these catchphrases. They're in there. They're saying cool stuff that they heard on the internet. And, oh, my God. You got to do this, do that. <laughs> you just go in there, you sounding really good. Like these guys, they should have a camera. They they will make a great video better than mine. <laughs> more entertaining than mine, not more informational. But they don't have the knowledge. They just how can I explain it? Stop trying to be like the guys you see on social media. Learn how to actually do it. That's what my channel is about. All right? It ain't about yelling and screaming and cussing. 
they telling people, oh, oh, ah. It's not about that. It's my channel is strictly about information, mindset. Now I dibble and dabble out of each topic. And I stick on one topic for a long time. That's why you'll see like a lot of videos about the same topic back to back because I always feel like I missed something. I could have said it a better way. So let me redirect you to how to search through Repetite Fitness. If you want to learn how to lift, play my all playlist. If you want to learn how to diet, play my summer playlist. If you want to have motivation, play my New Year's playlist. If you want the mindset, watch all the videos that I've been posting lately. Right now I'm in the mindset. This is mindset that I'm speaking on, right? Um, my last video was talking about sugar coating. It was called Sugar Daddy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Don't be a sugar daddy. Uh, so that was earlier today. Um, well, that's now really. I'm uploading it now as I'm making this video. Hey, man, I'm trying to regurgitate as much videos as I possibly can. He will be tripping, man. Stop tripping, man. Stop doing. Also, I'm going to say this like I said in the last video and I said in the last five or six videos lately. Stop doing. If you're doing something, if you're following a program, a diet plan, you're listening to somebody's advice um, and it's not getting you nowhere, if you're not reaching your goals, especially if you've been doing it for a long time and you know you've been doing it the way they said to do it then most likely they're either lying to you or they just don't have the knowledge to be teaching oh god damn everybody everybody can't teach you all right don't listen to everybody man analyze even if it's coming from me believe none of what you heard even if it's fit by me and with that said i will <laughs> yo but um yeah man um even if it's from me man believe none of what you hear half of what you saw and especially if somebody does not have anything to show you. Everybody got something to say. Speaking is easy. Talking about it is the easy part. So that's why everybody talks about it. It could be somebody who never lift weights in their life, but they're going to tell you how to lift weights. They ain't going to tell you the right things, but they're going to tell you some things. The same thing with diet and anything else in life. A broke person will tell you how to get rich. And some of these people, I ain't gonna lie, some people, like, okay, when it comes to a broke person telling you how to get, a homeless person, if you think about it, a homeless person has nothing but his brain, that's it. He don't got no TV, he ain't got no internet, he ain't got nothing, so that's a pro and a con, like, we can easily Google something or look up something and, and get the answer. He gotta sit there and think, he gotta, he gotta have his brain, you know, as entertainment and everything. So his mind is working all day. So heck yeah, I believe a homeless person is gonna have some good ideas. So if he's telling you something, he might got some good, he got, he might have some good points. He might got billion dollar ideas, he just never moved on it. Or he felt like he never had the opportunity. But if, if, when there's a will, there's a way. Just remember this, man. Um, take nothing else from this video. Where there's a will, there's a way. If you got an idea and if it's positive, um, like me with the Rapid Time Fitness thing, with me with the, the, the sponsorship, the Javi Coffee, and everything else I'm doing, my future plans, things that I ain't even done yet, um, the workouts, the diet, the losing 120 pounds, and, and everything that I've accomplished and, and working on accomplishing. Every day I put something towards those goals. Every day. Every day. Every day. Muscle building. Every day. Dieting what I eat. Um, learning how to perfect it even better than I already got it. I got it in a smash, but it can, there's always room for improvement, all right? Never think you know everything. People that think they know everything don't learn nothing. Know-it-alls know it -alls and never learn anything because they... You're not gonna, if you think you already know, then you're not gonna fully listen. Why would you listen to me if you think you already know everything that I'm saying? So, 
put aside that pride and overconfidence, all right? You can pick it up later if you want to, but put it aside when you watch my videos. Put it aside. You know what I'm saying? If there's a few things that you disagree, there's I expect that. I expect that, and that's cool. But put it aside. Look, Watch my videos with an open mind. I'm not saying at the end of the video you're going to agree or that you should agree with everything. You know, but don't be in the uh-uh stage. I, I'm trying to pull people out of that. I've been telling people for years who've been watching my channel, beginners are usually, they start off in the uh-uh stage where you say uh-uh to everything. I've done it. I was in the uh-uh stage for like, I've been lifting for like eight years. I was in the uh-uh stage for like the first half. And even after that, I was halfway in the uh-uh. I'm in the uh-uh stage right now if you think about it, but I know. I'm saying uh-uh from, what is the uh-uh stage? The uh-uh stage is where you say uh-uh to everything. You're a beginner. You're going to say uh-uh to everything except from the people who, everybody, my mom said this a long time ago when I was a kid. Everybody got a certain type of person that they listen to. You know, you got men who only listen to men, women who only listen to women, old age, age groups, genders, and religions, everything. A certain look um, people only listen to certain you know you should only listen to certain people when it comes to certain things I'm not gonna listen to no offense but I'm not gonna listen to somebody who has not lost weight about weight loss advice I'm not gonna listen to somebody who does not have any muscle about how to build muscle now yeah everybody's genetics are different and this and that and the third just because somebody doesn't have big bulging muscles don't mean they don't know how to build muscle some people are just below average genetics. That doesn't mean they don't know what they're talking about. I know that. Somebody's going to say that I beat you to the punch. Boom. I know. I know. Man, dog, when you talk to me, people that disagree with me when it comes to fitness, just understand that I've been in the game long enough to I've heard pretty much everything that you're going to say. Everything. That doesn't mean that you're wrong about everything. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that don't compete with somebody that's trying to teach you. Don't argue with somebody that's trying to teach you. Same thing with me. I got things that I'm trying to learn, and I'm not going to argue with the people that are trying to teach me. Maybe I disagree. I'm going to just be like, okay, I'm going to leave that part. I'm going to do these things that they said to do, but I'm going to leave. I'll take the good, leave the bad. You know, I try to keep my videos to where there is no bad, but hey, I'm a human being, man. So... But just know that I know the game, all right? I wouldn't be repping Time Fitness if I didn't. I wouldn't be able to show you those before and afters if I didn't. I wouldn't be able to blah, blah, blah if I didn't, da, 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 blah, 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 blah